Hello YouTube and welcome to another episode of Foodie on Keto. Sweetheart, what are you up to? Darling, I was looking at the 603 big fat marriage Indian invites, but I'm not able to find cauliflower masala in any of the menus. Well, sweetheart, I trust you will do a much better job than any one of them. Then let's throw it all away. We are going to cook cauliflower masala. Cauliflower deep fried and then cooked with tantalizing spices, which you only find in Indian weddings. What are you waiting for? Go get ready. Let's go. Let's go. All right, lovely people, let's get started. In order to begin the process, here I've got around 550 grams of cauliflower, which is cut into big florets. And what I'm gonna do now is simple. I'm simply gonna throw these cauliflower florets into hot oil for a deep fried massage. And I'm gonna deep fry them on medium heat for about seven to eight minutes or until they turn golden brown. And once they are golden brown like this, just take them out and move on to the next step. And here goes some oil in a pan and to this goes a teaspoon of cumin seeds. I'm gonna let the cumin seeds splutter and once they start spluttering, I'll throw half a medium sized chopped red onion and cook this on medium heat until it turns golden brown just like this. And once your onions are golden brown, throw 2 teaspoons of chopped ginger and 2 teaspoons of roughly chopped garlic and we are gonna let this cook for another 2 minutes until the rawness is gone. In goes a teaspoon of turmeric powder and two teaspoons of Kashmiri red chilli powder. Now Kashmiri red chilli powder is only used to give a nice and red color to your cauliflower. If you don't have, do not worry. But if you have, it's the best thing to use. Let this cook for another minute and then I'm gonna throw puree of one medium sized tomato. And now is the time to throw some salt to taste. So here goes salt. I'm gonna give it a good mix again and let the tomatoes cook on medium heat for roughly seven to eight minutes or until the oil starts separating from the tomatoes. And once your tomatoes are cooked, here goes two slit Asian green chilies and some ginger juliennes. Give it a good mix and throw about two and a half teaspoons of coriander powder about one teaspoon of red chili flakes or red chili powder and half a teaspoon of mango powder. Mix it again and just add a little bit of water. You do not need to add a lot of water, just a little bit is needed so that all the spices are mixed with the onion, tomato and ginger garlic paste. And now is the time to throw our deep fried golden brown cauliflower florets. Using a spoon or a spatula, mix them very gently because they are delicate, soft, juicy and succulent. And once all these spices or once your cauliflower is coated with the spices, now is the time to throw about half a teaspoon of garam masala and half a teaspoon of cumin powder go some chopped coriander give it a good mix once again and you're all done this is the kind of cauliflower one can expect it's spicy hot juicy and full of flavors and if by any chance you have 603 indian invites like me throw them all away and cook your cauliflower masala but before that, click here to subscribe to our channel.